I'm going to start crying. <laughs> Thank you nice so much. Nice to see you. How you doing? Good, good, you good. You feeling good? Yeah. Anytime Christine Lund sees Sergeant Salinas Rios, it's emotional. The two crossed paths in October during a life or death emergency along this stretch of Tuscawilla Road. I just know that um, if it wasn't for Sergeant Rios, I'd be dead. On October 8, Chris was out for a late afternoon bike ride along this stretch of road with which she was not familiar. And then... I had no idea what happened. I have no idea. This dash cam video shows Chris lying in the roadway unconscious with witnesses coming to her aid. Whatever caused her bike to crash, her head hit hard on the concrete. This image from Chris's Fitbit shows how her heart rate soared during the ordeal. There was apparently a, um, a nurse, a male nurse that was in the traffic and he got out and he said, she's dead. Sergeant Rios pulled up to the accident moments after it happened. She said she doesn't usually take this stretch of Tuscawilla back to the substation. Something pulled me there and it pulled me to you. She called an ambulance and waited as medical teams tended to Chris and her injuries. She followed the ambulance to the hospital, not knowing who Chris was or whether she would survive. I couldn't let you go by yourself. The crack on Chris's helmet helped doctors quickly determine where her head hit the pavement. This is the point of impact. There, there you go. Then from cards found in a pocket on Chris's bike, Sergeant Rios was able to determine who she was and called Chris's family. Your husband that night told me that you were in a medically induced coma. Right. And I prayed for you and I continued to pray for you. So do I get to hug you? You get to hug me. <laughs> Four years I've been saying, everybody that doesn't wear helmets an organ donor. I would have been an organ donor. Sergeant Rios says it's just as important for adults to wear helmets as children. And Chris, well, she's living proof. Through my experience, it is so important that people wear helmets. I can't say enough how that helmet saved Christine's life. It saved her life. Chris will tell you that it was more than just her helmet. Now I think of that there's angels out there trying to help all of us, and we need to respect them much more.